Hello once again mga ka C++ Ngayon naman ang ating pag-usapan ay tungkol sa inverted pyramid But before that I would like to inform you that I will speak in English a little bit But uh, I'm not really good in English Kaya kung ano man ang aking accent o grammar ay maaari nyo nang baliwalahin dahil aminado akong di, di talaga kong magaling dyan basta ang mahalaga ay maintindihan ng aking mga viewers ang tutorials na ito kaya ang aking payo ay wala ok this is our program last week so uh, let's let's check it this is the pyramid but uh, I am, I am going to invert the pyramid okay this is our program so uh, I'm going to copy it because we are I'm just uh, going to change some of the variables copy and going to the in place so if you uh, run this one it's a pyramid but but I'm going to change some of the uh, condition and the look, look condition so that it will uh, print the inverted pyramid so okay let's start with a moment and I will change it so a is equal to let's say five and I think this is one and B is equal to one also is B minus minus is I'm going to say also minus minus this is inverted all right B minus minus and if the condition is true the space all right so that's enough C is equal to 1 C remove this one this one so a times c plus plus oh, I think this equal here Let's check. Hmm. There is now C out. Why? I think this one good. Eight ABC A is equal to five. A is oh, that's why. Why well, I'm going to write that? is supposed to be it's greater equal to one my god see that's eight so this is the inverted of pyramid and now we're going to 
make an explanation how it is happen paano paano ang run ng loop this is a nested loop group of a for loop is a nested loop so integer natin ay abc abc is is uh, they call it variables so yan ito na yung ating uh, program na ang uh, input or output ay uh, inverted uh, pyramid so let's check once again sorry oh uh, here there is a uh, One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Nine, nine, nine columns. Okay, let's start. Integer ABC. Ang ating variable ABC. A is equal to 5. So, uh, hindi ko na ipapaliwanag itong mga ito dahil uh, kung kayo ay uh, nag-umpisa pa lang sa program, kung nakapag-umpisa na kayo, ibig sabihin, alam nyo na itong mga ito. So, mag-umpisa na tayo sa uh, circulation or the logic uh, for the for loops kung paano magraran yung program so integer abc a is equal to 5 a is uh, greater than equal to 1 yes the condition is true so going to next loop b is equal to 5 also b is greater to a na 5 uh, negative so if negative uh, it will uh, disregard or it will disregard the C out and going to the uh, next loop so uh, C integer of uh, the variable uh, C is equal to 1 also and C is uh, less than 5 times 2 because our a is 5 so 5 times 2 is 10 so c in a 1 i less than e less than to 10 yes so if it's yes the condition is true it will print the asterisk so one asterisk and going back to there c plus plus C now is equal to 2 and C is less than equal to 10 condition is true again so point print asterisk so going back C now is equal to 3 uh, equal to 3 C is less than to 10 yes asterisk going back C now is 4 the 4 uh, uh, C now 4 I uh, less than to 10 yes asterisk c now is 5 5 is less than to 10 yes asterisk so c now is 6 c is less than to 10 yes asterisk c now is 7 7 is less than to 10 yes asterisk C is uh, 8, 8 is less than to 10, yes, asterisk, and C is equal to 9, 9 is less than to 10, yes, asterisk, now going back, C now is equal to 10, 
10 is less than 10 negative since negative just like here negative the condition is negative this will get c out the condition is negative this will get c out so going to the uh, uh, so going to the end line uh, end line meaning next next line or next row so going back to the very first very first loop so since going back a plus plus uh, a minus minus a now is equal to 4 so a is greater than or equal to 1 uh, positive so going to next loop p is equal to 5 p is greater than equal to uh, is greater than to a in a 4 yes so print space 1 space so going back b minus minus b now is equal to 4 b is uh, greater than to 4 negative so this regard c out going to the next loop c is equal to 1 once more so uh, c is less than 2 4 times 2 4 times 2 is 8 so this now is 8 so because our a now is 8 4 so 4 times 2 8 so c C is equal to 1. C or 1 is uh, less than to 8. Yes, print asterisk. So print 7 asterisk. Uh, so we count 7 asterisk until, we dub, until the condition is false. So once it falls, going to the end line. And going back there a minus minus now a is equal to 3 a is greater than equal to 1 yes condition is true going back to the next loop p is equal to 5 p is greater than to 3 now a yes correct so print aster um, uh, space going back p minus minus so now is 4 4 is greater than to 3 now a yes 1 is space so going back b is now 3 uh, 3 is greater than to 3 negative so this we got c out going back uh, going to the next loop c is equal to 1 c is less than 3 times 2 3 times 2 is 6 so c no 1 is less than 2 6 yes asterisk so going back c plus plus now c is equal to 2 2 is less than 2 6 yes asterisk so print 5 asterisk there because the condition is uh, it will print 5 asterisk and then until the condition is going to false so it will disregard the c out once again and going to the end line and going back there to the first uh, loop okay now a is equal to 2 2 is greater than equal to 1 yes so condition is true going back to next loop p is equal to 5 p is greater than to 2 yes print asterisk so 
since uh, positive it will print or it will print the uh, it will print the uh, space not asterisk so going back there b minus minus for now is uh, greater than to 2 yes print space and going back once more b minus minus now b is equal to 3 3 is greater than to a yes space now uh, b now is going to 2 2 is greater than to 2 negative so next loop c is equal to 1 c is uh, less than equal to 2 na a times 2 2 times 2 4 so c is equal to 1 so c is less than to 4 yes print asterisk going back c plus plus now c is equal to 2 2 is less than to 4 yes asterisk so c plus plus c now is going to 3 or go or increase to 3 3 is uh, less than to 4 yes as this uh, once more 3 c plus plus now c is equal to 4 4 is less than to 4 negative so this will get c out going back to the end line just like that so ganun lang ang ikot ng ating program babasahin niya lang yung mga condition at uh, may mga condition kasi tayo na kung positive at wala namang C out na nakalagay dyan babasahin niya yung next loop ayun tong next loop pag nag positive to ang C out ang babasahin niya ECC out niya yung o in output niya yung space kung ano man ilalagay mo dyan so kung uh, negative disregard C out and pupunta sa ibang loop ngayon kung itong loop naman na to ay nag negative pupunta sa end line pero kung nag positive may C out dyan yan yung input niya o output niya ganun ang uh, ikot ng for loop or nested loop so uh, once again I would like to thank you all for watching this video sana may natutunan na naman kayo sa uh, episode na ito ng C++ programming ito ang yung lingkod Rolimac saying goodbye and God bless you all thank you very much